We shouldn't be doing this. <sighs> we're not Americans that we suck. Okay, risking our lives trying to do video while driving have you not seen what happens in those videos what videos they don't know what they're doing and then they, you hear accidents no. you see what i mean look at this hi guys it's hannah belay again and i'm excited because i'm going on a boat to shoot Just for forbes you see i have somebody filming me right now and he's abby oshadi he takes pictures this is ridiculous <laughs> Basically, and he's really angry because he has to hold the camera for me. And you see, he doesn't understand that he's supposed to be supporting me. I so support. Yeah. This is ridiculous. Okay. So anyway, we're going to take pictures. And Jackie just did my makeup. Yeah, so I'm, so, I'm just excited um, to do the photo. Abby, you're in the... You're in the... <laughs> 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 I'm excited and... Okay, you can... Oh, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> this is so ridiculous. <laughs> Keep your other leg nice and straight. No, the front leg. Bend the back leg. Oh, God. <laughs> Can you see my face? Can you see my face? What is that all about? What's the verdict? Not too bad. My hair. So, I fit with some of your... You don't know what he just did. You don't know what Abby just did. Yes. Basically, can it see me clearly? Is it in focus? I think it was some of... This needs to be... This needs to... Did, is, am I... Yep. Okay, listen, I understand that some of us have deficiencies, Abby, please, I understand that some of us have deficiencies and stuff like that. How can I basically, Abby basically came to me and was just like, what's, you know, what's, what's on your chin? It's my hair, please. It's the hair under my chin. I understand that some of us get it there. Why did Abby say, what's, what's this? And you touched it and he actually said, oops, oops, I didn't know, I thought it was, okay, I'm not involved. Anyway. I'm just gonna, me and Abby, we have a professional relationship. Yes, yeah, show Abby. We have a professional relationship. And I understand that I'm not gonna take this personal. Excuse me, excuse me, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna take Abby. Abby. I was trying to. <laughs> But to be noticed by them just made me feel like I have something really important and it just gave me all the encouragement to want to continue working hard at it. So yeah, I was just smiling the whole week, had the photo sheet and I was just happy and you know, it just really, really came at the right time for me so I'm so grateful. When I got interviewed, it kind of made me think about my story again. If I was to do this all over again, I would still go hard, like even when people are like, you're overdoing it, you're overdoing it. Obviously, you have to do things in moderation, like you can't kill yourself because in moderation you can work hard and that's what I feel I was doing and I will go back and do that. But p to people who didn't have a focus or vision felt like I was overdoing it. I'll never take that back. In those moments where I never gave up on what I wanted or the vision that I wanted and I was very, very specific and not caring if people were kissing their teeth or moaning or blah, 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 blah. I got the image that I wanted to create and those were the things, it was, in, it was those things that people gravitated towards. I hope I'm making sense. I guess what my, if I'm trying to take that as a lesson, I would always say to people, with the strength that you have, work as hard as you can at your dreams. Um, work hard now, you will play later. There will be a time, a season where you can just do the things that you've you thought would you would never be able to do okay you can always buy clothes you can always go out there's always going to be an event you know so there is a time to work hard and the second lesson is if you have a vision okay and it's, it's sometimes it's hard for people to communicate what vision they have in their in their heart in their mind and trying to let other people see it i guess i would say be patient with other people to see what you want and just try and be as articulate as you can but never give up and never settle and never make someone talk you out of what you're trying to do if they can't see it you have to make them see it for you even if that means you going to learn the skill yourself that's just like the little thing that i just wanted to say um i don't know why like the, the interview just kind of like sparked up memories and so guys i'm going now peace um it's really late it's actually very very late my edges have gone every day one falls out of the back because my hair's like this short which is so annoying but yeah i'm going now guys i'm going home <laughs>